Namaste guys, Ashish here for Namaste Tech and today we are talking about a very important feature which you can use on Redmi Note 4. Since the arrival of fingerprint sensor like we have here on Redmi Note 4, it has got extension to do a lot of stuff right from taking pictures and taking screenshot and whatnot. But one of the most useful feature has been to use it to unlock apps. Now, locking apps was also available before, but it was using pattern. But now with fingerprint sensor edition, it is very, very convenient. So let's start with how you can use your fingerprint sensor to unlock your apps instead of using pattern. You have to do two things here. First, you need to enable fingerprint sensor to work with app lock. Second, you need to go and turn on app locks. So let's start with the fingerprint thing. So go to settings. And here you can see there is called as lock screen and password. Tap on this. Now tap on screen lock and fingerprint. Now go to apply fingerprint to section. You can enable it for lock screen, which is already done. Privacy password and app lock. I'm going to enable it for the app lock. Say so, okay. Now that I've enabled this for app lock, we'll now check how to app lock and unlock apps using fingerprint sensor. Now there's an app called a security which is built into MIUI 8 and it comes with other OEMs as well. Everybody has their own way of implementing. Tap on this and it gives you a lot of option what you can do with your phone and from security perspective. Now we have already seen second space, check out that video. We have already seen dual apps, check out that video as well. Today we are taking an app lock. So we'll go into this and here you can see you have a couple of apps which you can lockdown and only works when you are using fingerprint sensor. Well, now this is one more setting to take a look but have a look here that almost all apps are available which you have downloaded from your play store and even the native apps like the gallery, contacts and dialer, messaging are well protected. Now let's go to settings and here you can see it says app lock turned on, password is required to open apps, lock settings, what it says is how do you want to lock it. So if when the device is locked, when the device is locked or after exiting an app, when device is locked or one minute after exiting an app. Now these are conveniences. Now if you have phone with you all the time, you can change it to one or two minutes, but still I would suggest keep it secured. You can change your password now. The setting we need to enable is unlock with fingerprint. It will be off by default. So if it's off, now even if it's on and if you have it off on your main setting it won't work so you need to say unlock with fingerprint as turned on and you need to scan your fingerprint so i'm going to do that and there you go now let's take a look at these two settings which are new i've seen it in my ui 8 when it was launched but this is new first is unlock all apps at once this is a new feature so if you unlock one app all the apps which you have put it on lock becomes unlocked they lock back again when you lock the screen or reboot your phone second is add my account now in case your fingerprint sensor is not working or you have forgotten your pattern you can use a mi account to unlock it this is another additional feature that you have to use it now let's have a quick demo you already saw that gallery was locked so i'm going to launch it and it says Either I draw a pattern or use a fingerprint sensor. And if I use a fingerprint sensor, I get it. Now, even if I quit it, let's say it's still in the memory, I'm going to tap it, still ask for the password. So remember, it all depends on the settings. If you do your settings properly, especially the setting which I've shown you here, I'm going to show you again. This setting is pretty important. Now it locks your apps only when you lock your device. If once unlocked, everything is unlocked and works. Now make sure to put the settings setting when the device is locked or after exiting an app. This is important because if you don't exit your app, it's still unlocked and the whole purpose, so in case you give it to somebody, fails. So make sure to do it. So that was all about app locking on Redmi Note 4 on MI UI 8. Thanks for watching the video. If you did like it, hit the like button, share it with your friends who have just got the Redmi Note 4. Probably show off, you know, how to lock the apps with a fingerprint sensor and subscribe to our channel for more videos that's going to come.